Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to learn about how images are formed by convex mirrors. We'll also see a problem and discuss some real life examples. So let's get started. First, let's understand what a convex mirror is. A convex mirror is a curved mirror where the reflective surface bulges outwards like the back of a spoon. These mirrors are used in various places because they have some unique properties. When light rays hit a convex mirror, they reflect outwards. This happens because the curved surface causes the rays to diverge. Here's an important point. The reflected rays appear to come from a point behind the mirror. This point is called the focal point. But so when we look into a convex mirror, the image we see is actually a virtual image. This means it can't be projected onto a screen because the rays don't actually meet. The image is also smaller and upright. Here are some important things to consider while solving a problem. Always put the reflective side of mirror towards left hand side. Draw a vertical line tangentially to mirror. The left hand side should be considered negative and right hand side should be positive. Always put object on left hand side and take distance from the mirror negative. After finding answer using mirror formula, which we'll discuss further in this video, if the image distance comes negative, it shows image formation on left-hand side and positive distance shows image formation on right-hand side. If magnification comes less than 1, it shows image is smaller than the original size of the object. If magnification is greater than 1, it shows image is bigger than the original size of object. Some important notations. Let's come back to our question to see how this works in practice. Imagine we place an object 50 cm away from a convex mirror with a focal length of 25 cm. We want to find the characteristics of the image formed. As we have discussed earlier, we always put object on left hand side and take its distance from mirror negative. So here U is negative 50. Since focal point is on right hand side, so it is taken as F is equals to 25. If we know any two of them mentioned on screen, we can easily find the third one using mirror formula. Here we know U and F. Now we are going to find V, the image distance. Substituting values in mirror formula 1 by F equals to 1 by V plus 1 by U. We get image distance V is 16.67 cm. Here is a quick fact that convex mirror always forms smaller images than actual objects. So the image formed is virtual, upright and smaller than the object with 16.67 cm distance away from mirror. Convex mirrors produce virtual, upright and smaller images which helps cover a larger field of view. This is why they are used in various places like Car side mirrors, they help drivers get a wider and diminished view of the road behind them. Store security mirrors, these mirrors are used in stores to monitor large areas and prevent shoplifting. Traffic mirrors, these mirrors are placed at intersections or sharp turns to help drivers see oncoming traffic from blind sides. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more fun and easy explanations. See you next time.